Hey guys, Fabi Beetle here, and I'm going to be showing you how to fix the PS3 not being able to read the game, or the disc, as you can kind of see. Ah, hold on, where's the, wait, let me just bring this up, okay, as you can see my disc, I'm going to put it in, and it's not going to show up, look, right now, it's the only way it says game, that, and I'm going to put it in. In. Now, you're gonna hear a clumpy sound too. There, that sound. That means it's not gonna work in the disc. The Blu ray, the database in the Blu ray, is something wrong with it. So, what you're gonna wanna do, see it's not showing up. <clears throat> what you're gonna wanna do is first off, Turn your PlayStation off from here. Or if you have the old play PlayStation, turn it off on the switch in the back. And then turn the switch on if you have the old PlayStation. Or if you have the new one, just turn it off. Wait till the light goes off. Now, none of these games are working. Okay, so it's off. Now, you're going to hold it. Hold the PlayStation button, so you hear one beep. Keep holding it. You hear two beeps. Keep holding it until you hear the third beep, then let go. There, I let go. And then you have to wait for a little. Your screen is going to be like that. going to show. And now it is in the obfuscating mode, which means... You can now hold it again. So I'll hold it. One beep. Then you hear another beep. Right now. And then you hear a double beep. Like that. And then you can let go. And um, it'll say this. So we're going to want to connect it. Oh, hold on. Connect your USB. And if you don't have one, just hold the home button. But it's better if you connect it. Oh, I, hate, I hate when you put it in one way and then it doesn't go and you turn it around and then it doesn't go and you put it the normal way and it works. And hold the PlayStation button until this shows up. And then the menu changes to this. Now, if your PlayStation is freezing, you're going to have to restore file system, which is number three. And if it is just not showing the disk and it's giving you this read error, hit rebuild database. It's not going to delete anything, except for if you have like some music playlist, but that's like easy, you could put it back. Basically, like, it's basically a, like clearing a temp folder in your computer. Then it's hit, yes, you'll have to control it with the key analog, I mean the, the keypad, you can't use these. And then just hit X. Um, it says it usually takes an hour, but mine took like two minutes, so it's going to shut off. And it's going to ask you about an HDMI um, cable, if you have one plugged in, which means for HD aspect ratio. So you're just going to hit yes if you get that. Like that. Oh, you have to turn your controller on again. Okay, hit yes. Now it's going to say... PlayStation rebuilding. Oh, first you have to say yes quickly before 30 seconds. It's gonna say it's gonna rebuild the um the database on the system storage. Press X for OK. Then I say rebuilding database. Do not turn off the system. And just wait till the bar goes full. So yeah. Once the bar gets um filled, it'll say it'll restart to PS3. You could check your game data, your trophies, whatever, all of it will still be there. And the game disc should show up. And if it doesn't, I'll show you another trick. Actually, I'll tell you it now and then I'll give you the full things in another video. Um, you have to, you need two discs for this. So once you put in the disc of the game you want to play, wait till you hear the poof sound and then you put in another disc. Just hold it in like right on the outside. And then take the, that out, and then it'll show. 
I know it's hard to explain right now because I can't actually do it because it's showing it's updating. I mean it's rebuilding a database so I'll make another video if this one doesn't work. Or you could always try cleaning the disc and like blowing into the PS3 hole. <laughs> Just getting the dust out and stuff. You could try wiping the fingerprints off. Yeah. Okay, so as you can see, rebuilding database did not turn off the system, 100% complete. Then you hear a click sound and boom, it is restarting and you have a fresh database, basically a temp folder. Test if it works. <laughs> so yeah, thanks. Okay, just log in there. Um. Okay, now see if it worked. There you go. You see your disk, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. And if it didn't work, then watch my other video on how to fix it. It's gonna say part two, but it's probably not gonna be out yet. It'll be out soon. <laughs>